I know I complain about the other... Oops. <laughs> I know I complain about the other vehicle's windows getting broken too easily, but... It gives you much better visibility than this thing does. I mean, seriously. It seems there wasn't really much difference between the uh, two routes. Because I noticed that the um, tracking path switched very quickly once I started going right. Actually, there is a stop I need to make on the way, and that is because we're passing guy, passing guy, passing by where that guy is who will make Molotovs for free alcohol. I think I just clipped something there, I'm not sure. And I'm not sure why I want to make out, make Molotovs with my alcohol either. Except maybe that I can sell them for a little bit more. Because if I use them I just know I'm going to burn myself to death again. Okay, here we go. You wait there, Jen. I'll be right back. Have I ever let you down? No, you haven't. Get me a couple bottles of whiskey. Okay, let's just quickly swap out all of my alcohol. I just need a Okay, that's all of it. And that's given me uh, uh, eight Molotovs. Lovely. Oh what the heck, let's equip them in the hot bar again. <laughs> I know I'm gonna regret this. I just know it. There. Okay. Let's resume. Oh, apparently there's a suicide over there as well. I'm glad I didn't drive down there now. What did I just hit? Well, I'll say this thing for the other truck as well, it's faster. It accelerates a lot better than this. Oh dear, was was that guy moving me? Well, I don't think he was, but still. That was a bit of an unfortunate position for him with my spiked grill. Act 2. Okay. Well, we've left the resort behind and are now on to chapter 5, heading into the city. Mixed blessings. Okay, I can tell now that means something is going to go wrong. It's just a question of what exactly that will be. I think he's seen me. Those poor people. We can't just leave them like this. And you shouldn't be standing outside the car, to be honest. I hear something over there. Ugh. Um, yeah. Anyway, let's go in and see what I can do about this. To be honest, I knew something was wrong from the moment I heard the bells, and then the shaking on the screen didn't help at all. So, yeah. Ooh, a whole load of zombies. 
and the big guy. Oops. Didn't mean to use that, but still a ram. Okay. Hmm. Oh. From the front I did one damage from the back. Oh yeah, electric. Not bad. Okay, uh Ram. He didn't hit me, but I get the feeling I don't want him to. He did kick me when I was too close. Uh from the front I did whole one damage when I attacked him. <laughs> um But from behind I did full. So yeah, that means I've got to get behind these guys whenever I find them. Uh, let's see, kills gain stamina, increased damage with melee weapons, stamina cost reduced. Because since I'm in the city area now, I think I want to start boosting my combat tree in general. Well, this one decreased stamina cost when fighting groups. Um, I don't know what counts as a group. So I'm just going to have to go with um, increased damage output, I think. Because I don't really have any problems with stamina at all. And then there is increased durability or damage against the opposite sex. Um, hmm. <laughs> well, I'll think about that one later. For now I'll just take extra melee damage and deal with the rest of these guys. Yeah, not very much cutting action. Dragon demons from all over the city. Go talk to Mother Helen. Maybe you can figure out how to silence those blasted bells. Mother Helen, Mother Helen. Um, here we go. Mother the Helen. The lifeguard said you'd be coming. One of ours, possessed by a demon, locked himself in the belfry. Please help us silence these bells. They are calling to the devil's disciples. Okay. Since they're attracted to noise, I can see why. And they shut the door behind me. Lovely. Okay. Nope. Nope. Yeah. Third time to charm. Oh, lovely. Thug. Maybe there's something we can use. A thug in an enclosed area. Even better. Oops. Okay, I should have realised that that was um, his combo attack. And I should have realised he would swing at me. He usually does if you have time to do two hits. Okay, that's both his arms off. Come at me, come on. Whoops. Did I just try to poke him in the eye with the hilt? Come on, down you... Go. You tried to bite me, didn't you? Okay, church bell keys. Oh, that should be what I need to shut off the bells at least. Hmm. Apples only give you back one block of health. I thought it was more than that. Oh well. Oh wait. What's this? Toxic? Toxic mod. Okay. Um, yeah, okay, let's stop messing around and get those bells shut off. 
There we go. Thank you. You saved us. Those demons nearly pushed their way into the church. And Frank, his soul was lost to the beast. You're welcome. Awe inspiring mace. Very high force. And high. well, fairly high damage. But worst durability and handling. Okay. You need supplies, food, medicine? I'm sorry, but the city has already been looted. You won't find much unless you know where to look. I will help you. But only if you promise to help me, for it is the Lord's will that you are here. Yesterday, we lost our water supply. Two brave souls left this morning to check the pump station. They haven't returned. Well, that was very brave of them. Going out into this and risking being infected. Sure. Can you find out what happened to them? Or at the very least, turn the water back on? If something happened to them, then odds are good that I won't be able to find out what. Um, so, she's right, at the very least I can try to get the water back. Um, but, I think I'm actually going to call that an end, end of session here. So, thank you for watching everyone, and I'll see you next time.